From Aladdin to, De to Lion King, Disney aims to box up its heights in 2019. Well, you know what? I'm not watching these remakes that Disney is making. I know dumb people will still buy these remakes because they're nostalgia. Because they really want to see the same movie again. Because if you had always seen the animated movie Dumbo, Lion King, or Aladdin, why, what's the point of seeing the live action movie? What's the point? December 16th, of course, is topping $29 billion in the last three years. $20.9 billion, not $29. How Disney has reaffirmed its status as one of Hollywood's readers. Mickey Mouse Studio has scored a major hit in 2018 with Fiddy War. 2019 could be fruitful with a new Star Wars episode. Marvel movies and remakes that will probably sell despite being the same movies that we already have seen. 95 years go young, Walt Disney Company is in rude health and face a proliferation of new streaming platforms. Disney has no choice but to reinvent itself to compete with Netflix and Amazon Prime. The D2019 will be a host of projects in the pipeline, and of course, of course, being competition. Comeback classes, Disney will threaten 2019 early with Mary Poppins Returns. But the only reason why people are about, want to see that movie is because it has 2D animation in it. I think that's the only reason I've seen people why they want want to see a movie besides the Disney drones who will grow see every single movie if it has a Disney logo on it. After Beauty of the Beast, we have Jungle Book and Alice in the Wonderland. We'll bring an updated version of Dumbo, Aladdin, and The Lion King. And of course, we have another Marvel movie called Captain Marvel. I'm not excited to see it, but like five people, the SAWs, and like most of the Marvel fans are actually excited to see us. And of course, Star Wars, IX, not excited to see that at, at all either. The last idea was a complete pile of turds, and so it was even worse. And then Frozen, that was so no matter what. Okay. Another Toy Story movie is coming out. I just rolled my eyes about that. At that, and they're coming out with a Frozen two. I rolled my eyes about that, but this is still gonna make money anyways, cause people still watch these dumb kids movies. Disney is going to soon own the entire movie market if we don't stop them. We have to put Disney against the antitrust laws and separate Marvel from Disney. We have to separate Star Wars and Lucasfilm from Disney. And we definitely have to separate Fox from Disney because Fox is not Disney. Okay? Alien is not a Disney property, first of all. And many other Fox properties, like Ice Age, is not owned by Disney. It's now, now it is. Um, everything is owned by, will soon be owned by Disney if we don't stop them. Because Disney will own The Simpsons as well. That's for sure. And Disney will own Disney already owns Deadpool since they own Marvel. But now they own the license to Deadpool. They own Planet of the Apes franchise. They own the Predator series. They 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 own Avatar. Of their own Kingsman, which I think is Marvel anyways. Funny Dad will be owned by Disney. And you know, actually that's a based off a book. Rio will be owned by Disney. No, nah, not the maze one is a book. Kung Fu Panda and Independence Day and The Legend of Dragon will, How to Train Your Dragon will be, all be owned by Disney. Oh wait, How to Train Your Dragon and Kung Fu Panda went to um, Universal. I forgot. And we all know Ice Age will be owned by Disney. And that's basically it. Fox is completely owned by Disney. They lost the biggest series, Star Wars, but now all the, all the entirety of Fox will now be owned by Disney, which is absolutely dumb, so screw you, Disney. Get out of here.